All right, what's going on, guys? Today we are watching Tower of God episode five. I always, re I really just don't feel right saying no season before the episode. It feels so weird. Um, episode five. Uh, very excited to get into this episode. Don't have much to say today apart from my ramble. <laughs> uh, but yeah, without further ado, I'm just gonna get straight into the episode, and we'll talk about the previous episode through the opening, as always. Let's get right into it right now. So, to recap last episode, uh, episode four, they were in the midst of a very, it was a very cool episode, um, with the fights and interesting character developments and whatnot. Um, we have Bam Kun and Rak, uh, they're finally joining the fight, or they finally joined the fight. And Korn, Korn absolutely went off. He smacked the opposition. Um, after the lizard girl had given up the throne because she got she lost she bit lost her mind a bit when she realized Bam's sword was like one of the princess's swords. Um, so that was interesting. But now Bam, Korn, and Rack have control of the throne. I don't know how long for. I don't know any more how more round. How many more rounds there are, or if it just keeps going until the, te all the until there's only one team left. Um, but I think, I don't know, like my theory, as I was saying last episode, if you watched with me, the the there was another princess in the cell. So there were the hair and, what was her name? Anak the, the two princesses there, maybe. And the, the, the second princess was on a team of Rachel. Yeah, I couldn't, couldn't, couldn't stomp them here, I swear. Well, couldn't smart. Rack just wants to fight. <laughs> what is that bag? I don't get it. Wow. Well, that's how we know which is the real one. Interesting. That's a tiny squirrel thing, man. What the hell? Is he just a girl? <gasps> Finally, Rock gets a fight. Hey. <laughs> just got spinning. <laughs> Oh, Rack, you are really strong, god damn. <sighs> wow. Oh, it's her. These are big words. <sighs> Boring. Does it? Cool looks cool with a ponytail. Hmm. 
Croc boy, you're gonna get fat eating all that chocolate. Cone looks cool as far right now. If the bag copies the ch chocolate, for example, and then, but the same thing would happen to the chocolate that happened with the crowns, or he could just make the crowns disappear of his own volition, vo volition, volition, of his own will. These are some cool looking teams. So like the chocolate just doesn't disappear by itself. It's still real chocolate digesting in rack stomach. Hmm. I'm, it's probably thinking too deep into this. So is he just going to let Rack fight? The dude doesn't give a fuck. Oh. Oh, she's creepy. Oh. Really? <laughs> That's cool. Bro. What? <laughs> he didn't do anything about it though. This dude is smart as shit. What the hell? <laughs> so the allies those allies will just give up in this in this game but be used to help these guys yeah they're just giving up wow and it's only a bonus game anyway so they can still climb the tower which is cool that's such a cool play back on <laughs> oh 
Oh boy. Hey, it's the guy with the eyes. Hmm. Oh, they're taking out the other teams first. Interesting. Ooh. Oh. I don't think so. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Mm. <laughs> well, now that we look at her, she doesn't seem to be human. She seems to be a different race. Hmm. <laughs> A rock. Yeah, it's obviously Rachel. What the fuck? Am I supposed to be saying Rachel or Rachel? It's, the spelling is just Rachel, so I don't know. Can someone let me know. What is going on? Did that team want Bam to accept the fight against... Anak, is it? And so now they're on Bam's side? Weird. I'm confused. Oof. Oof. What are they interested in then? I'm right saying she's not human, right? Just because of the horn. Oh, Kun's a badass, man. Did any of them get him? Oh, God. Yeah, bodysuit girl, you've lost this one. Jeez. I'd fucking leave before you might actually die. For yourself? She clearly has some other fucking goal in mind. In hindsight, heals in battle. Not so sure that was a good idea. Ooh. 
What's the noggin? The crown. Oh, for God's sake. Something cool about the fucking best hap about to happen, I swear to God. <laughs> of course it would. Oh my God. I need to shut up. <laughs> what the hell is this? Holy fuck. Oh. Oh shit. Bam was about to go rage mode, god damn. <laughs> I forgot about you, I'm not gonna lie. This dude's huge. She's huge, so this dude is huge. Well done. Bro, did we fail the test? Oh, okay. That's fine. Oh, well, it was, was it? What did it do to it? I kind of just disintegrated. God damn. It looked like water, but it, you know, obviously wasn't the same color as water. <laughs> Is that water? <laughs> Instant coffee. Wow. Special cafe latte. And that cool fucking coffee machine rig and it's just that. <laughs> Hmm. Is he talking about Bam and Rachel? Oh. Oh. 
Okay. Fair. Hasn't formed a contract with an administrator. You shouldn't there about any constraints before. Interesting. I'm a bit lost, but I'm kind of on track. Oof. He took a pretty hard bat to the head, like. What is going on? <laughs> Chill ass ending song. Oh, okay, so no winner of the crown game because Bam exploded basically. <laughs> um, that was interesting. I'm a little bit lost now because. One, names are a little hard to remember, where you can basically only remember four names in the whole show. Um, and two, like Shinzo, for example, I forgot that that w that's a their way of like saying, you know, their power in that world, like like Haki or whatever. Um, and it wasn't a name of someone, so I was a little confused from there. And then now the whole forming a contract with an administrator to use Shinzu or not kind of lost me a bit but I've, I'm on the right track it's not something I need to re-watch to understand it's something I'll just pick up eventually and it'll just I'll kind of just figure out what they mean but obviously this show is full of mysteries and it needs to be figured out to the per by the uh, audience especially the ones that haven't read the webtoon it was an interesting episode and I am very still unsure about Rachel and what she desires and what that team desires considering they didn't want to win the crown game hmm maybe Rachel wanted to go to the top of the tower but she couldn't and so she had to form a team or she knew about Bam and his abilities and she's somehow helping him or something I don't know I'm very lost but that's okay, because I'm still very interested in the story. And overall, very good episode. And that's all, all I have time to say. So, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.